Stop, 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 to Suzuki, stop, pony, stop, pony, Nelly, the elephant, practice, my practice, build, or twinkle theme? Twinkle theme, alrighty. So let's get our feet together. Can you make best friends with my feet? That's it. And where's that bow hold? Oh, amazing, 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 amazing! <laughs> Very good. Right, let's see. How many amazings are you going to get this time? Shake. And make how many amazings are you going to get? Amazing, 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 amazing. Well done. Five. Brilliant. And violin up. Beautiful. Let's see if we can make that shoulder stay relaxed. Good work. So big bows or little bows for twinkle theme? Yeah. yeah. Do you hear happening with the 
ringing sound. Yeah, can you hear a ringing sound afterwards? Can you hear it at all afterwards? Yeah. yeah, is it shorter or longer than when we have it on the kink? Shorter. Yeah, so which do you think sounds nicer? That one, definitely. So let's do Twinkle Theme one more time. Do you want to play it with the tiger? And let's see if every three we can have that beautiful ringing sound. was over the holidays. Very good. Excellent, well done. And you've got your I Can Read music, that's brilliant. Uh, and you were gonna... Yeah, we worked really hard on Allegro. Fantastic. I think he almost has a coming of children in <gasps> perpetual motion. Wow, what? <laughs> Amazing. Okay, so let's do our coming of children first, shall we? Dive straight into the mountain piece. It's a tricky one, isn't it? Hang on, hang on a second, hang on a second, hang on a second. When I said dive straight in, I didn't mean quite like that. It's like jumping into the pool with all your clothes on. Let's just make sure that we're ready, first of all. Put your swimming costume on. <laughs> okay, we're gonna start at the red for this piece, yeah? Okay, wiggle your two for me. Wiggle your two, that's the one, okay. Did you run out of bow? Mm. You did, didn't you? <laughs> Should we do a little exercise first? Mm. No, okay. Good work. Yes. Can you be quiet during the last lesson? 
Would that help? Hey, how about you come and get one of my pens? I've got awesome pens. No, even my pens are not gonna be, not gonna satisfy. Look, I've got a black and a red pen. Lira, well done. Not um, screaming in protest in response. <laughs> Okie dokie, so what are we thinking about? Yeah, up bows finishing around the red so that you've got nice space to go up again. Good work. worry that they haven't got it perfectly right the first time they get their credit and this is such a massive piece isn't it would you like one of those so many to choose from mm. sure very good my love well done So when you play it, so can you play it every practice this week, even though you've got your credit for it now? And when you play it, can you see if your bow can get even better at stopping on here? Yeah. Do you have um, bow monkeys? No. Oh, I I do not, but they might be the cutest things I've ever seen in my life, so I'm going to go and get them now. What are you going to practice while I'm out? Or are you going to shake? Huh? A leg one. Okay. So you check your amazing, 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 amazing hand on the bow. Mm -hmm. in your bag, please. <laughs> and then I'll bring them in. 
trainees of forgetting about sight reading. So can you go and get your new book from Mummy? Hmm? Have you done anything with it yet? Yeah. Yeah? Great. What have you been doing with it? Um, Page 15. Oh, okay. Um, you said 15. Really huh? You said 50. Yeah. Page 50. Uh, for the rhythm, yeah. Yeah. Um... Okay, brilliant. Uh, so let's do some rhythm first of all. Let's do. Have you done your um, gooseberries? No, I haven't. Yeah, no. Okay. <laughs> Just stuff in blue and jello and rest. Okay. Okay, brilliant. So, which one would you like to say for me? So let me tell you, this is called a time signature. 
Do you know what a signature is? Like if you sign something, like you see probably your parents go Whoa! on something, like an important letter or something, or if they sign for a parcel, yeah, that's your signature. And the music has its two signatures. It's got one for the time and one for the key. We're not going to worry about key signature right now, but the time signature is two numbers on top of each other, like right is standing on your head. And the one that's important for us right now is the top number. So that two tells you that you've got two beats in each bar. Yeah? Okay. So do you want me to say it with you or are you going to do it by yourself? Okay. One, two, one, two. Very good. Is it jello or jello? <laughs> so annoying, right? Ready, play. Blue. I said play, you're not playing. Ready, go. Blue, jello. Awesome. I've got a challenge for you. Next week, can you say your jello's right the first time you do it? <gasps> do you think you can? Or do you think it's impossible? <laughs> well, if you think you can, then you probably can. And if you think you can't, then you definitely won't. So what do you think? I think you can. I think if you and mommy practice your jello's in the funny slow way that you've got to do them <laughs> then you'll remember next week won't you should we do one more which one do you want to do great okay one two blue blue yellow yellow <laughs> jello jello no jello jello make them go all together ready go blue blue that's right. Blue, blue, red, blue, yellow. Yes! <laughs> okay, do it for me one more time. Keep focusing all the way to the end. Ready? Go! Good girl, would you like a stick on your book? Stepping up and stepping down, or finger numbers and don't know. Okay, so when we read pitch, we want to name the first note and then just talk about the relationship from the note before. Okay. So rather than a a a a b b b b c c up c c up c c up c c up, you're going to say. So do you know what that first note is called? Well done. And then you're going to say. So a same same. Same step up. Can you see how it's the blob has gone one step higher? We don't worry about the stems, those are the long bits. Okay? So let's do it together. Ready? Go. A, same, 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 step up, same, same. Now what happens? Good work. Brilliant, that's exactly right, Noel. Well, well done. There's somebody cleaning the windows. Should I go and tell them to stop? No. No. <laughs> I should go and say thank you very much, Oscar, for cleaning our windows. <laughs> in a minute, he's going to come in here and clean them. On the inside, too. Yeah. Okay, good. So, can you find. When we're looking at these lines that are called the stave if the notes go from one line to the next space that's a step isn't it 
What? Yeah, because they're like stairs. What about if we skip out a note? Yeah, so if you miss this note out, we call it a skip. Can you find me a skip on the page? So it's going to be a line to a line, like this. Yes! Or a, or a space to a space. So you can never have a skip that's one of each. doesn't exist. Yeah? Can you find me another skip? Are there any more skips? Might be the only one. Can you find any more? Yeah, I'm not finding any more either. Shall we change? Shall we change page? Yeah. What about if we look at a really hard page? <gasps> oh my goodness! Can you find me a skip on that really hard page? Page seventy-two. So it can't be a skip, can it? Because they've got to be the same. Can you find somewhere that's the same? In line one, I can see somewhere. That's literally the same. I mean, a skip up or a skip down. Let's check. Can you see it? Yes, well done. Can you find one of these two bars? Excellent. Well done, you. Very good. So, Valerie, just to explain, mm -hmm. what you've done so far is great and it's helpful, but we're going to move away from that because if you're looking and you're thinking that's one, that's three, that's open A, that's two, mm -hmm. that's like looking at a word and spelling out, that's da, a, t, so, yeah, so it's da, t, and then it doesn't make sense because it's date. Do you see what I mean? Okay. So what you're trying to do when you look at these um, patterns, and we'll talk more about how to describe the patterns next week, mm -hmm. is how each note is um, like uh, related to the other notes. Okay. Because if you were going to play that on the cello, even though it's a different clef, you wouldn't think that's F, that's G sharp, that's A, that's B. You would just see, oh, that's a bit of a scale, and then there's a funny like up and down swoosh, and thank you, Kit. Um, so that's what, you're, that's what you're training her to read is the okay. patterns of the notes and to identify patterns, steps, skips and jumps. Okay. So we'll do some more on that. So for now, if you can keep doing the same pages, let's not go for pitch, let's not go beyond. You could go up to lesson six if you want to on pitch, but just um, when you're looking at it, describe it. So. A2, same, step down, same, step down, same, etc. And then have a go at playing it. Okay. Um, and then for the rhythms, you just keep doing what you've been doing. Fantastic! What an amazing lesson! Wowzers! Good work! Very, very good indeed. Okay, so... Um, perpetual motion, did you say you'd started? We did, yes. Okay, great. So keep going on that. Mm -hmm. um, and rather than doing any more past that, just see if you can try and get those bows on O'Connor children to stop in the right place okay. and keep thinking about your other reviews. Mm -hmm. One more stick of Madam? Mm -hmm. Well done. What about another? Do you want another one of these? You need your book for your sticker. Three, two, one, go. Thank you. You're welcome. Very good. Excellent. 